guys. How you doing? Hey, how's it going? I love it. It's background. Oh, oh, thanks. Thanks. Yeah, this is some some cool stuff. I got Flash Gordon's signature right here and uh, Todd McFarlane over here. All kinds of cool stuff back here. This Ooh. is just a whole life's worth of 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 hoarding um <laughs> so uh aiden first off minor spoiler alert i gotta I, huh. I i i will release this post launch but Lovely. can i just say thank you for the footloose dance um you're welcome just, i guess it was so it was so good uh was that the best thing you've ever done in your entire career because it was the best thing <laughs> i've ever seen it's maybe the hardest uh, we rehearsed for <laughs> man i wish you were in it too that was like so much fun it's a sequence uh it took like at least two weeks while we were still in quarantine over zoom to get the dance sequence started and to learn the moves and then countless hours of breathing heavily through thick masks. Cause it was mm. the pandemic uh, while trying to learn these moves in a studio. And uh, I think there may even be some behind the scenes footage of all that, that will be coming out. So we'll get to see it all. If that's your favorite sequence. You're going to, you're going to have a good time. It's so well. I'm a huge Kenny Loggins guy. I'm old. I don't know if you can tell. It's it's uh, it's I'm, I'm quite old, and uh, I'm a big fan of Kenny Loggins. So as soon as that kicked on, I was like, I was right there with you. You know what I mean? Uh, <laughs> anyway, uh, so you know there are a lot of unique superpowers on the show. It's one of my favorite things about the show, especially compared to other comic book properties. Uh, now with the addition of the Sparrow Academy, which superpower on the show do you guys think is just the coolest? I still think my own. <laughs> you know, when I was thinking about this question myself, I was like, Lila's powers are pretty cool. The only thing that gets me hung up on yours is that, like, if there were no other superheroes around, and then I was like, well, then you can't really, then you, what can you do? I don't know if you can do anything with it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, my brain my just thinks, now. I'm sorry. I'm I sorry. I this power. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I think I think it is a really great power. Yours is really good too. What? Just the jumping around and stuff? No, the whole deal. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's how he blinks. That's how I do it in real life. I just do that. <laughs> it's actually I'm really like, funny I, watching it on set. Like, yeah. well, <laughs> it's you have to just go like this. I, I get and totally up, pretend and about goes, it because <laughs> everyone's there to sort of do the scene, so they cheer me on. So okay. okay. Okay, like hold, and then I get to like pretend like I'm walking through space time and do the other side. It's very fun. It's fun because I get to copy that too. Also, I get all the variety of copying stuff. everyone's stuff. Yeah, we worked for like an hour to try and or something like that to try and sort of get in the same space to do that uh, that briefcase. Yeah, you can't really tell how much we worked a lot on of that for that. But- for that scene, but we we had like choreographed this whole thing yeah. when we're like blinking together with the briefcase. Maybe yeah, if you looked at it now, you might be like, oh, I can see there's some. Yeah, yeah. Take a stethoscope. I'll, re- I'll rewatch it just for that. Thank you. Like, that's the that's spot right there. So also another one of my favorite things about the show, uh, you know, just the awesome. The soundtrack's amazing. So if you guys had to pick one, like what's your favorite needle drop out of the three seasons? Uh, man, that's, uh, that's tough. That's a I like one. cinnamon. I thought that was... I love the way that I think it's just perfect for an action sequence. So I love when that popped up in season one. That's way back. I loved it when they played Backstreet Boys. But then I also loved Billie Eilish and I also loved Golden Brown. I just think the music is pretty fun. Can yeah, there's, it is. This this season, this I don't know. Again, minor spoiler alert, but this season, the the, the higher love cover so good i was like that's an that's an amazing cover and i didn't know i, I just talked to uh I, I just talked to steve and he told me that that's actually steve winwood and his daughter singing that so i, I was like that's amazing um but yeah those are the, the backstreet boys you can't ever go wrong with backstreet boys you can't go wrong with backstreet boys they're back all right come on they're back yeah that's all what right. I, I saw those i saw them in concert with nsync or not nsync uh new kids on the block and I, it was like one of the greatest nights of my life. So, wow. Yeah, it was okay. incredible. It was incredible. So, real quick. Can you guys talk a little bit about the evolution of your characters dynamic now that the stakes are bigger than ever and you guys get to work together again? No, that's that's the answer I wanted. Actually, that was what I was going for. I was like, I don't need anything. Sometimes he doesn't want to answer questions. I'm yeah, sorry. get off my back, man. Sometimes he just gets <laughs> like, that's fair. That's fair. Evolution of characters. Right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> evolution of characters um we soften up as characters like we sort of 
<laughs> Speak for yourself. Since, well, okay. Well, since season two, though, mm. I think we've come a long way. The end of the world brings people together. Yeah. And time. Yeah. And also, like, just the effort of the day, just like, ah, oh, enough of this. Let's just, come on. Let's not, let's get over this rivalry, man. I get it. There's nothing like an impending apocalypse to turn you into best friends. So, yeah. guys, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me. I don't want to take up any more of your time, but thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you.